Welcome to my channel. My name is Tan if you're new. In today's video we have a unit that was sent over from divatress.com. Today's unit is from the brand Outre and it's from their Perfect Hairline collection. I got her in the style Fabian or Fabine. I don't think I'm saying that right but I'm pretty sure you saw the thumbnail and the title of her so yeah. <laughs> I got her in the color DR4 slash Sandy Blonde. If you want to find out my thoughts and opinions on this unit, you already know. Continue to watch. But before we get into the video, make sure you're subscribed and also make sure you follow me on Instagram and TikTok. They're both at tan.tip. Let's get into this install. <laughs> Okay, so before we even get into my review of this unit, I want to apologize if the angle has changed and also if the lighting has changed. The angle has changed because my battery died, so I had to change out the battery. And the lighting has changed because it started to thunder. I don't know if you noticed, it was starting to get a little bit darker. But yeah, it started to rain and thunder and I was like, I know you guys are not going to be able to hear me over that. So yeah, it's about two hours later. but. Anywho, let's go ahead and talk about Miss Fabian from Outre. The cap construction is your typical cap construction with three combs in total, one being in the back, the other two being at the very front. It also has adjustable straps, a security band, and it comes with a 13 by 6 lace parting space. According to the stock card, it is said to have a fully hand-tied 13x6 frontal, ear-to-ear -ear soft HD transparent lace, 
natural baby hairs, comes with pre-attached elastic band, pre-plucked hairline, and heat styling friendly. I agree with all of those except for the pre-plucked hairline and the heat styling friendly. I can't necessarily agree to the heat styling friendly because I haven't put any heat on this unit yet. In my opinion, this unit wasn't very pre-plucked. Now, I said in Altre's Dominica, I think it was Dominica, how I feel like a lot of the times Altre will pre-pluck the top of the unit, but when it comes to the sides of the unit, it's like there's just like a ton of hair. Now, I tried to go in with my tweezers and tweeze some of the hairs out, but that was taking a little bit too long for my liking. So then I just went in and I started ripping the hairs out. Of course, little by little, so I wouldn't create too many holes in the lace, but I feel like it kind of worked for the most part. It could be tweezed a little bit more, but hey, this works for me. This unit does come in an array of colors and I'll make sure to pop it up here somewhere on the screen. I went for the DR4 slash Sandy Blonde just because I'm like, it's summertime and summer is meant for blonde. Now don't get me wrong, we can wear blondes throughout the entire year, but I don't know what it is about this ash blonde that just kind of screams summer going into fall type of vibe. As far as the texture goes for this unit, I would say that she's pretty silky. Now as far as the length of her, well, she started off as 18 inches, but we saw what I did. I got scissor happy and I decided to cut her. And I think I want to say this is about 12, maybe 14 inches now. I don't know. To me, the cut of her elevated this unit. The 18 inches with this color, we're just kind of screaming, I'm a Barbie girl in a Barbie world. But I want to be, I'm a Barbie girl in a Barbie world, but it's corporate. Yeah, no, maybe so. I don't know. To me, the cut of this unit with this color and the curls, I don't know. It's just giving me grown and sexy. Now when it comes to tangling and shedding regarding this unit, expect it in the long run. Because she is a curly colored synthetic unit, it's bound to happen. Now because I did go ahead and cut this unit, I feel like I might be able to get away with the unit not tangling and shedding so fast. Granted, I do think it might net up or mat up, net up, mat up, y'all know what I mean, in the back on the nape of the neck. So I don't know, should I start doing a, not a series necessarily, but maybe whenever I install the units, wear it all day and then come back at the end of the video, well, by then it'll be night, to like just show you how the unit wore throughout the day. Is that something you guys want to see? I don't know. Let me know down in the comment section. Now, the question we always have to answer in almost every single video is if she's big head friendly or not. Currently, I do have my hair straightened. Yes, y'all. My hair is straightened. I am not rocking my dusty twist underneath this unit right now. <laughs> but it's only because it's July and July is my birthday month. But anywho, yes, she is big head friendly. Lastly, let's talk about the price of this unit. On divatress.com, she does retail for $83.99. But if you plan on picking up one of the specialty colors, expect to pay about a $2 upcharge. Overall, I absolutely love this unit. The color of her, the fact that I cut her, I don't know what it is, but whenever I cut a unit or I just have a curly bob type of unit, it just always makes me feel like really put together and really beautiful. I don't know why, but it just does. And now that I'm actually looking at her, she kind of puts me in the mind of Mei Lin and Promise. So if you have Mei Lin, she's about this length but if you have promise and she's kind of like starting to tangle up and mad up cut her down to 18 inches and then I feel like you will have Miss Fabian I don't think I've been pronouncing that right this entire time but anywho if you like this video please give me a big thumbs up also make sure to subscribe before you leave and also make sure you click the bell that way you're notified anytime that I upload a video follow me on Instagram and TikTok they're both at Tan Dotson I'll be sure to have a direct link to this unit in the description box below so make sure you check that out I don't have anything else to say though except for I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.